In this question, the following measurements were taken from a healthy 33-year-old volunteer. There is inulin, glucose, potassium, uric acid, and PAH. And the values for urine and serum are given separately. Now what is the question saying? The question is saying that assuming a hematocrit of 50% and a urine flow of 1 milliliter per minute, which of the following is the best estimate of this patient's renal blood flow? All right, so they want us to find renal blood flow. Renal plasma flow and renal blood flow is not the same thing. Renal blood flow is equal to renal plasma flow divided by 1 minus hematocrit. So initially we have to find renal plasma flow. Okay, so first let's find out renal plasma flow. Plasma flow. So renal plasma flow is equal to um, urine concentration and we measure plasma flow using PAH. So all these values are unnecessary. All we need is PAH. Urine PAH times urine flow divided by plasma PAH which is equal to urine PAH is going to be 100 milligram per milliliter so 100 milligram per mil per milliliter times urine flow is 1 milliliter per minute 1 milliliter per minute times 1 divided by PAH you uh, plasma PAH is going to be 0 0.2 0 0.2 milligram per milliliter so we are going to cancel some numbers some units out here the milliliter and the milliliter is gone um, and then the milligram and the milligram is gone so we're left with renal plasma flow is equal to there is a 10 here so I'm going to make it a thousand on top uh, and the denominator we have two this is going to be milliliter per minute which is also equal to 500 milliliter per minute okay so that's our renal plasma flow. Now that we have renal plasma flow, let's find the renal blood flow. So our renal plasma flow was 500 milliliter per minute divided by 1 minus hematocrit, hematocrit is 50%. So I'm going to say 0 0.5. So now we have 500 divided by 0 0.5 milliliter per minute so now we have 5000 divided by 5 milliliter per minute which is equal to 1000 milliliter per minute so this is going to be our renal blood flow answer is going to be D